PolitiFact knocks Kamala Harris's claim she has great approval ratings. We rate the statement false. The fact checker took aim at the VP for remarks she made during an ABC interview. The liberal website PolitiFact offered a brutal fact check of Vice President Kamala Harris's false claim she has great approval ratings. During a recent interview with ABC News, Harris was asked about her dismal polling, with the reporter pointing out how she had the lowest approval rating of any vice president. I'm curious how much a role, if any, that you feel race and gender play in that. ABC's Lindsay Davis asked. Well, there are polls that also say I have great approval ratings, Harris attempted to push back. I think the point that has to be made is that there are attempts to create distractions away from the accomplishments of our administration. A report published Tuesday pushed back on her claim, telling readers, public polling results do not support her assertion. At the time the ABC News interview aired, 538's average was 39.7% approving of Harris's performance and 52.3% disapproving, for a net of 12.6 percentage points. Underwater, PolitiFact wrote. Meanwhile, the most recent poll in which more people approved than disapproved of Harris's performance was from October 2021 and was more than 100 polls ago. That poll, conducted by St. Leo University, found Harris above water by two percentage points, which was within the poll's three-point margin of error. PolitiFact went on to say October 2021 was the last time her polling average was above water and then listed a slew of recent polls showing her approval rating ranging from 39 to 42 percent and disapproval rating ranging from 51 to 57 percent. When we asked the White House for evidence to support Harris's statement, a spokesperson told us Davis asked an open-ended question, and that some polls, albeit ones conducted early in Harris's tenure, showed the vice president with positive approval ratings, PolitiFact wrote. The spokesperson added that polls have found that certain subgroups of voters register strong approval of Harris, such as 72% of black voters in the July SSRS CNN poll. That wasn't enough to spare Harris from PolitiFact's truth o -meter. We rate the statement false, PolitiFact concluded. This fact check is quite the turnaround after PolitiFact backed up Harris's recent assertion that Florida decided middle school students will be taught that enslaved people benefited from slavery, which PolitiFact said was mostly true. Harris flew down to Jacksonville, Florida last month to slam the state's black history curriculum, fueling a spat with government. Ron DeSantis Florida's black history curriculum details harsh conditions slaves endured and also explains that slaves develop skills which, in some instances, could be applied for their personal benefit, both while enslaved and when they became free. 